Hello, ni aje karibuni kama uko na degree ama diploma in any subject naomba hunisikize ni kueleze vile unaweza tumia degree ama diploma yako kupata European Parliament visa na hisitoshe bado utastand utakuwa hunalipwa kama hutapata around 200k za Kenya na hakuna kitu yote yenye wewe unahitajika kutumia ku apply hii kitu ni data yako unaenda unanunua credit ya Safaricom ya ambao unaingia una apply hii kitu na kama uko lucky we unapata ya yeah, ukitumia na maybe hauna job hapo Kenya ama uko Kenya na unatamani ku travel ya yeah, so naomba unisikize kama ndio unaniona mara ya kwanza mimi naitwa Mulwa Mutuku na kama wewe ni returning viewer nasema shukurani naomba uendelee kuni support na nakuwish all the best in your job search so naomba sasa uende kwa browser yako uandike hapo European Parliament Trainee Fellowship itakuletea results alafu nataka nikupeleke step by step hadi tufike mwisho na nikuambie maujanja za ku apply hii kitu ju inatoka next month applications zinakuaga start of May the 1st of May to the 31st of May na nikueleze vile unaweza ipata ni sawa shukrani naomba tuanze So hapo kwa browser yako unaweza andika Schuchman Trainee Fellowship ama Traineeship European Parliament na itakuletea results. Results zenyewe angalia yenye inakaja yenye unaona hapo kwa nini yangu alafu click hiyo. So tuko hapo kwa website website yenyewe ndio hii inakaa hivi unaona imeandikwa Traineeship with the Secretariat ya Schuchman ndio hiyo yenye inakaa hivyo inakuelezea kwa nini unaweza work with them inasema itakuongezea knowledge na itakufunza vile huku European Parliament ina work of which yenye ita boost career yako na upate unaweza pata job place zenye uwezi so next place ni hiyo hapo can i apply ndio inasema unastahili kuwa over 18 years na ukuwe umetoka Europe but they offer a very limited number of traineeship to nationals of other countries so sisi tuna deal na hiyo nationals of other countries ndio tunataka ku apply to hope tutakuwa katikati ya wenye watachaguliwa na pia inasema unastahili ukuwe na degree so uzuri ya hii visa inakuwa gani all inclusive so pia wewe inachukua watu wenye wako disabled so kama unajua mtu yote ako disabled unaweza mshare hii video kama ako na degree ama diploma pia yeye haende ajaribu bahati yake maybe anaweza kuwa lucky hapate Ukipatokiwa disabled pia niliona benefits zake ziko more unapata unapata wenye unapata the end of the month pia ni iko juu kidogo bora yeye ataezana na hiyo maisha ya kukaa huku peke yake ya yeah, akiwa far away from the family So how to apply unaona hapo inasema select a minimum of three traineeship so minimum ni three hiyo usisahau na inasema kama utakuwa shortlisted watai, kuna documents itahitaji who supply for eligibility alafu watakutumia admission letter via email ya na vitu zingine kadhaa zenye hapo unaona kila mtu anaweza fulfill so unaona applications zinaweza unaweza only apply from 1st to 31st of may saa hii leo ni on 12th of april so kuna wakati mzuri ya kupanga kila kitu ndio upate on 1st utakuwa na hizi vitu zote so twende hapo tuone monthly allowance unaona hapo kuna countries zenye zina hofa zina watakuwa wanalipa up to 1700 pounds per month for the next 5 months so kama unatoka Kenya uta expect hiyo ndio ikuwe chini kidogo but at the end of the day itakuwa ni do mingi kama 200k yenye utapata ni do mostly kama Kenya ndio upate hiyo do inahitaji ukuwe na job mzuri unaona hapo kuna pia wanapeana travel allowance ya 300 pounds With that 300 pounds unaweza toka hata mali yenye huko uende ukaone Olympics France. So hebu twende hapo niwaonyeshe hapo how to apply. So utaklik hiyo mali yenye imeandikwa how to apply utaona hapo kuna traineeship application page. Alafu sasa itakupeleka kwa application page. Wacha twende niwaonyeshe application page yenyewe inakaa hivi. Can I apply inasema fulfill hizo requirements unastahili kuwa age 18 language definitely Kenya tunafunzwa in English provide a university level diploma usikuwe na criminal record na usikuwe umefanya Europe 
na usiku uko na study visa Europe so definitely ni kitu yenye mtu mwenye ako Kenya hizo requirements zote ako nazo so ujanja ya hii kitu ni ikifika on first unastahili u apply three jobs but from first usi apply jobs zote tatu mara moja ile course yenye umesomea kama iko hapo apply has the first job kwa sababu after some time itakuwa inakuletea ni watu wangapi wame apply then hizo zingine mbili apply the next one after around two weeks na the last one ikifika kwa sababu inaisha on 31st of May ikifika 31st the last one enda uangalie course yenye imeapplywa na watu kidogo click hiyo so unaona hapo kwa traineeship offer sahi nasema zero ju bado tuko April but from 1st of May itakuwa na courses kadhaa hapo courses kama dhati ama hata 40 wakati zingine zi upanda hata zinaweza kuwa 300 enda uklik hapo so, uone so kwa application ya hii visa inatakaga uh, ukuwe na euro pass cv pia hii euro pass cv ndio nataka nikuonyeshe ujanja ya kufanya nini ya kujiapply kwa sababu hakuna mali sisi tunataka ufanye nini tunataka ulipe mtu tunataka we uende uweke data yako ya ambao ujifanyie kila kitu uapply ukae utege kama utakuwa lucky pia Naomba utakuja kuniambia hapo kwa comments kama utakuwa uliona hii video halafu ukapata hiyo visa ya European Parliament. So hapo kwa Chrome yako andika Europa CV nikuonyeshe kila kitu vile unaifanya halafu wana kujeneratea CV yako murwa zaidi kabisa. Halafu God willingly unapata. So hapo kwa Google Chrome andika Europa CV then click nikuonyeshe yenye hutaenda kwa sababu hapa kuna ma clickbait mingi zenye zinataka uklik yenye tunataka ni ile yenye iko na badge na kaa ya European Union. So ni hiyo hapo yenye mnaona click hiyo then unastahili uingie hapo ndani wacha iload ni waonyeshe. Ndio hiyo ina load ina load ni hiyo create your Europa CV but itahitaji hapo create a profile hapa ndio uweze kuweka hiyo course yako ndio ufanye kila kitu upate wanaweza kujeneratea CV yenye utafanya nini utaupload ile mahali. Hii kitu yote ni bure. Hapa hatutaki ulipe mtu ati anakwambia leta ni kuundia CV international. CV international unaundiwa ya nini? Kama sivyo unaweza tumia AI uiambie ikuundie Europa CV. Sasa hizi ndio nimekumbuka ningewaonyesha vile unaweza unda a Europa CV ukitumia AI. Hii kitu yote tunajaribu ku avoid kulipa mtu yoyote kwa sababu hii channel yangu goal yake ni kutotumia agent goal yake ni upate kila mtu wa, kila mtu nataka kila mtu akuwe na equal opportunities mwenye ako na do mwenye hana do so ni hiyo hapo sasa hapa ndiyo mali ya create your cv so wacha ni cancel mimi sitaki ku register juu mimi sitaki kwenda hapo na sitaki kuunda hiyo nini ni kwa na already cv yangu mzuri so usiende hii mali yenye unaona ikiwa blue henda hii side yenye iko right unaona hapo mali imeandikwa create your profile hapo ndiyo mali yenye uta click Alafu itakuitisha inaitwa nini itakuitisha email yako ikuitishe jina ya yeah, uverify hizo vitu na yan, na ukue umeunda profile na inaweza kuitisha course yenye ulisomea hivyo so ni hapo click hapo kwa create account usiende ni hiyo sasa inaitisha hapa kama mimi inanitisha jina yangu ni kama nataka kuunda nini ni kama kuunda profile so mimi ndio huyo hapo wacha niweke jina yangu So wacha niandike mimi naitwa subscribe wa wa ndio my second name my last name in, inaitwa subscribe wa comment so hizo ndio majina zangu tatu alafu tena nitaishingia hapo chini niandike niweke email yangu so we utaweka vitu zako zile legit ndio ufanye nini uundiwe hiyo CV bure kama sivyo unaweza tumia hey hi ama unaweza watch youtube tutorials za kuunda nini za kuunda europa cv So kama mimi hapo nimeweka email yangu likes and comments at gmail.com then ni confirm the email hapo chini then ni submit alafu watanitisha vitu zingine kadhaa ndio waweze ku create profile yangu na waniundie CV yangu then hiyo CV nikishaipata nitafanya nini nita download na ndio nitatumia kufanya nini ku apply ile mali ya application So huko mwisho nilikuwa nataka tupitie hizi frequently asked questions zenye ziko kuneza zipata tu kwa hiyo channel msidhani ni story za jaba unaona hapo sasa ni maswali za kuhusu applications kama unaweza can i send a spontaneous application no kwa sababu nini applications zinakuwa only from first of first of may 
to 31st of May. Then kama uta apply ya 1st of May to 31st, unastahili uanze traineeship yenyewe October, wika October, November, December, January, February. So ikifika February itakuwa imeisha so but within hizo 5 months ukiwa huku unaweza jipanga na utafute maujanja zingine zenye unaweza fanya ubaki huku. So wacha niwaonyeshe swali lingine most common yenye najua mnajiuliza ni I'm not a cit number 5 I'm not a citizen of European Union member state can I apply wanasema yes. Wanahofa nini? Yes. The compi The competent authority offers a very limited number of applications to outside European Union. If you are selected, you will need to apply for any visa and residency permits and work permits. Any expenses will not be re- reimbursed. But your application yake kwagi visa ya European Union ni kwagi expe unaweza angalia online staki ni kudanganye bei yake. So unaweza angalia ni kitu yenye unaweza afford na pia kama unakuja kupata 200k ni aje ushindwe kulipa kitu ya 40k pia wewe kujilipia visa. So ni hizo pia kuna maswali zingine hapo nilikuwa nataka niwaonyeshe mambo na disability wacha tuendelee kusoma hivi have not been shortlisted or selected in the institution will I be asked to provide why my application was no hawata kupea any reason so unaweza endelea kusoma hizo maswali Ivo uone sasa ndio uweze kupata nini kujua more about it so hii ni part nyingine kabla ni part nyingine unaona number 20 i have a disability are there any benefits associated to it so unaona wanasema trainees wenye wako na disabilities watakuwa wanapata nini watakuwa wanapata allowances yenye iko up to 50% of the yenye watu hawa wengine So unaona hapo if the disability is less than 20% no additional payment will be granted. If the disability is greater or equal to 20% but less than 50%, the additional payment will be 20% of the monthly salary. If the disability is greater than 50%, the additional payment itakuwa more than 50%. So hiyo ndio video ya leo watu wangu thanks kama umeniwatch hadi hapa na huja subscribe naomba usubscribe juu content yangu imekuwa entertaining kama umefika mwisho naomba ufinye subscribe pia kama uko na swali naomba hapo chini uteremke hapo chini huniulize swali yenyewe nikipata time nitaweza kukujibu alafu pia nitakuambia nita kama hii ndio content yenye huu unapenda ngoja ya next week ya next week hiyo ndio itakuwa mzuri nyingine mzuri zaidi Ya yeah. nashukurani